So Meta, the company behind Facebook, just dropped $14.9 billion to acquire a company called Scale AI. And let me give you some insight on why they did that, because they were losing the race before this, but this could be their trump card to come back into the game. Now, most people using AI are primarily using OpenAI, Claude, or Gemini. Meta or Llama was no longer in the picture. Well, until now. Scale AI, if you don't know who they are, they help convert unstructured data, like messages that you may share between your friends, families, girlfriend, boyfriend, on Facebook, WhatsApp, wherever, into labeled text, which can be used to train AI models. So, in this case, Meta could use that to train based on your Facebook, WhatsApp, Instagram, all the information that they have been collecting on all of us who have accounts on it all these years to label that and use that to train their AI model to have better information and perhaps have that edge that they might have been losing because of ChatGPT, Claude and Gemini. Now, if you work in organizations working on building AI capability, this is serious news for you guys because this proves the point that data is still the most important part of all your AI models. Now, if you work in large enterprises as a tech leader, this is a good reminder to know that, hey, all the models that you're using in the background, what data are they learning on? And if you use any of these, is there an opt-out button that you would probably want to have for all the IP that you have collected all this while? Maybe in some WhatsApp messages, I mean, I have been part of WhatsApp group for every time there was a security incident. Now this would be great news for meta AI models, but for professionals who work as tech leaders in organization who work on AI capability, where I know I have been part of WhatsApp groups which have sensitive information and there is encryption. So it hasn't been clarified whether WhatsApp and Facebook messages are the ones that would be used to train the data, but I don't know what other data they have. So. My question to them would be, is there an opt-out option as an enterprise who primarily uses the meta enterprise suite for chat messages, for WhatsApp messages, for instance, there's so much of meta enterprise suite that is used in a lot of organizations. Are we going to get an opt-out option so all our sensitive data is not trained on? Let me know what you think in the comment and is there an insight that I missed? If you want to be on top of AI security insights, I'll see you tomorrow. Follow for more. Peace.